Hi, it's Panda Movies here. Today, I'm going to explain the movie called Tooth Fairy. Warning, there are spoilers ahead. Enjoy the video. The story revolves around Derek Thompson, a minor league hockey player known as the Tooth Fairy for his habit of knocking out the teeth of rival players. Derek steals a dollar from his girlfriend Carly's six-year-old daughter Tess and tells her that the Tooth Fairy doesn't exist one night. He finds a mysterious invitation beneath his pillow, which transforms him into a Tooth Fairy and transfers him to their kingdom. Tracy, his caseworker, and Lily, the head fairy, are among the people he meets. With them, he has a tense connection. Due to his harsh relations with children like Tess, Lily calls Derek a dream crusher. He'll have to work as a tooth fairy for two weeks. Later, he encounters Jerry, who gives him shrinking paste, invisible spray, and amnesia dust, among other tooth fairy gifts. Randy, Carly's 14-year-old son, despises Derek. Randy aspires to be a heavy metal superstar when he grows up. Derek begins to win Randy over after defending him against a bully, and he begins training him how to play his electric guitar better so he can win a talent show. Derek pays multiple youngsters a visit and tries his hardest to be a good tooth fairy, but he ends up doing more harm than good. Lily accuses him of being the worst tooth fairy ever and forbids Derek from receiving any more supplies from Jerry for the balance of his term, slamming his lack of faith in youngsters. After that, a fairy named Ziggy approaches him and offers him black market supplies. Later that night, the goods fail and Derek is apprehended by a mother of a child. Tracy informs Derek, while incarcerated that Lily has prolonged his sentence to three weeks. He does, however, offer to provide Derek with adequate materials if he begins to act like a tooth fairy. Derek is bailed out by Carly. Derek works on honing his tooth fairy skills and bonding with Tracy and Randy, but after he fails to make a goal in a hockey game, he vents his frustrations on Randy, telling him he'll never be a rock star. Randy tearfully smashes his guitar as his aspirations are broken, and Carly breaks up with Derek, telling him his worst problem is his inability to be hopeful and that he can't say what if. Tracy later arrives at Derek's house and reveals that he is a tooth fairy in training, but that Derek's unkind remarks have affected him more than others, much to Derek's annoyance, as he tells Tracy to leave. Derek returns to the rink the next game and sees Tracy. Tracy wants to instill the value of dreams in Derek by urging him to score a goal and go get Tess's tooth. Derek scores the goal with increased vigor, dons his tooth fairy costume, and flies away, while Tracy throws amnesia dust on the audience to obscure the incident. Tess notices Derek stealing her tooth at Carly's, but she swears to keep it a secret, and Derek apologizes to Randy and encourages him to pursue his ambitions by granting Randy a new guitar with his magic wand. Carly sees him as a tooth fairy downstairs, but she assumes he leased the costume for Tessa's sake, which makes her forgive him. Derek flies Randy to the talent show and immediately applies amnesia dust to him. Derek returns to the fairy realm to give Lily the tooth and is informed that he has been relieved of his fairy duties as a result of this task, as well as validating Tessa's belief. Lily informs him that he would never see the tooth fairy again and that he will be doused with amnesia dust. Derek says a cordial goodbye to Tracy before leaving. Derek is transported back to the talent show after Lily uses amnesia dust on him. Randy outperforms everyone and starts a band as a result. Derek makes a proposal to Carly, who accepts. Derek is shown playing left wing for the Los Angeles Kings during the end credits, and he doesn't recognize Lily and Jerry in the crowd. Jerry assists him in scoring a goal in secret, 